How many other bot promoters going to say they sparred with Tyson Fury and got a bit of cut on him and all? But he absolutely laced me after that. The worst thing I did was cutting him. This is Jonathan Aguilar with Pro Boxing Fans, joined by Izzy Asif here at York Hall, uh, the head of GBM Sports. Just some news uh, that came out today, Gilet Zhang against Deontay Wilder is in talks apparently. Uh, you, you like that fight? I love it. I love that fight. I love it. I think it's just right and all. I just think it's right. Zhang obviously lost and all. Uh, Wilder's come off a bit of a defeat against Parker. So yeah, I think it's a good fight. It's a right fight for all of them. It's going to be an interesting one. Listen, I, I'm not even... If, if the Wilder turn up on the last, I think... Zhang's going to have him as his number, but I don't see. I don't think that was the best of Wilder we've seen against Parker. I don't know if there's something wrong with Camp, camp whatever, but that's a cracking fight. Good matchmaking. And just finally, uh, I don't know how many people know this, but uh, obviously you said you were an ex uh, pro fighter. You did some rounds with uh, Tyson Fury back in the day. Can you, can you tell us a bit about that? This is a long, long time ago. So I was an amateur, and I think Fury was still an amateur then with a GB team, and they said they've got the heavyweight wants to spar in. I was a heavyweight, hard to get heavyweight sparring. So I think it about three rounds with him and first round he was just taking it easy with me for Tyson just kind of seizing me out and I did manage to get him with a jab which were not the worst thing I could have ever done because the next two rounds he absolutely laced into me and battered me I can't remember the last two rounds but yeah I sparred with Tyson Fury I did a few rounds with him and a few other champions as well so not, how, many, how many other bot promoters going to say they sparred with Tyson Fury and got a bit of cut on him and all but he absolutely laced me after that the worst thing I did was cutting him it was just as you checking it easy on me but listen credit to him for what I remember he did hold off and all when he was reached some Massive unit, massive. I'm six foot four, and that guy's huge. But listen, how well has he done? What, what, what great greatness has he achieved? Him and, him and AJ, and I think you're going to see the fight this year, the big one. AJ Fury, and it's going to happen in the Middle East. He can't compete with that kind of money. So do you think uh, he beats Usyk? I think he does. Too big, too big of a man, too big, and he can box as well. He's got the boxing IQ, Tyson. I think he's too big. But listen, Usyk's a freaking machine and all, isn't he? And he's smart. They got a great game plan. So, but I think, I think Fury's too big for him and he'll, he'll use his weight and reach on him and it'll be too much for him Alright Izzy uh, appreciate your time uh, good luck with everything uh, for the show coming up April 20th uh, just tell the fans finally uh, where they can see it and how they can get to it April 20th go on to our Instagram page GBM Sports a skid link there few tickets left if not it'll be live on TalkSport 7 o'clock I think it is April 20th what a card everybody said it's the best card we've done this should have been on a bigger broadcast but listen you can see fireworks and like my usual style we might introduce a knockout bonus just to entice them and get some entertainment on there because you know like we like entertaining. It's the business we're in. Brilliant, Izzy, appreciate it.